I'm Pastor George Borkart, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. Higher Things, that's the subject of today's Higher Things Video Short. Hey, we're celebrating our 20th birthday in Higher Things this week, um, and it's a good thing to talk about Higher Things, the name. The name actually came from a newsletter for the campus ministry at St. Andrew's Lutheran Church in Laramie, Wyoming, um, University of Wyoming. Marcus Zill was the pastor there, and he was one of our founding fathers, and his campus newsletter was named Higher Things from Colossians chapter 3. Let's take a look at there. And so, since you have been raised, if you've been raised with Christ, ta ano ze tete. Seek things above. Um, ano, above. Higher things. Um, that's where the name comes from. We're a Colossians 3 organization uh, where Christ is. So seek things above where Christ is at the right hand of God. Set your minds on ano. Set your minds on things above, not on things that are on the earth. So Higher Things came about uh, when a group of pastors thought that youth ministry was a little too on the earth and not Christocentric, not Jesus-centric enough. And these pastors uh, thought they would have a conference. That was 20 years ago. And here we are today looking at celebrating our 20th birthday. Now, youth ministry done Higher Things style is youth ministry centered on the solas. Salvation by grace alone, that is by Jesus alone, received by faith alone, from scripture alone. Notice it's not a cool looking pastor, trust me, nothing cool about me, and a guitar and um, watered down theology. If our young people can do calculus and geometry, if they can do physics and, and uh, biochemistry, uh, if they can do all those things in high school, they can do heavy duty theological things. And most importantly, they can have the faith passed on to them. And that's the mission of higher things to pass on the faith, the teaching of the gospel, salvation by grace alone, received by faith alone from scripture alone to the next generation. So they would run farther and faster than we have higher things. That is Jesus things, that is baptismal things, that is body and blood things, that is um, scripture alone things, that is uh, faith alone things. All those things which are foundational and yet more than foundational, which lift us up out of our sins and out of our guilt and out of our pain. See, that's the deal with higher things. It's not just six commandment stuff. You know, don't sleep with your girlfriend or boyfriend. It's, it's forgiveness, it's mercy, it's love, it's, it's law and gospel, not just law, but law and gospel. Mercy and grace and forgiveness. Instruction on how to live as a Christian, how to grow up as a leader, but also forgiveness for where you have failed in your life, in your school, in your relationships, and the like. That's the mission of Higher Things, to support the church doing those things from a newsletter in a little campus um, in Wyoming, um, Laramie, from some pastors, some faithful guys who were concerned that the faith needed to be passed on to the next generation and how we could do that. I'm Pastor George Borker, and we'll explore more Higher Things things this week. And this has been another Higher Things video short.